WFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. We got the S&Ps right now. You're pushing session highs. We're up 49 points. That's a solid 1.3% in the market. And you look at the acceleration yesterday, you almost got it all back, folks. That acceleration pretty much began at about 3,900. You traded down to 3,820. That was an 80-point move in the final four hours of trading yesterday. It's not even 10 in the morning. It is 10 in the morning. It just ticked to 10 in the morning this morning, folks. Uh, point being, we almost got it all back. We're at 38.82. NASDAQ 100, you're up 1.3% as well. The Dow up just over 1% right now. And how about the Russell up 2.2%. The Russell actually making it above any of the market highs that you had yesterday, 1777. Crude this morning, you're sitting at 98.30. You got above $100 briefly at about 3 a.m. Eastern time. Gold, Basically flat at 1711 right now and notes and bonds. You got the 10 year negative by seven ticks. We're right around 3% right now. I think we're just under that price uh, yield level of 3%, but we're sitting pretty much right at about 3% on the 10 year. The 30 year, some volatility as well. I mean, just look at from where we were at nine o'clock in the morning, man. You just had the 30 year trade up 18 ticks, even more than that from 138.12. When I started the program an hour ago, you're trading at 139 right now on the 30 year, and we jump over to the VIX. As this market trades higher, VIX trading a bit lower at 24.49. So I talked about a few different articles on the program last hour, but here's what we'll talk about. How about Twitter? Yeah, this is kicking off at 11 o'clock, I believe it is, Eastern time. It is from 11 a.m. till 12.30. So you have the judge is expected to rule whether they fast track the lawsuit. Now you have Twitter's team arguing that they need four days in September. That's all they need. Musk's team wants to push things back until February. It would seem like Musk just want to push it back forever, right? Because as of right now, he doesn't have to pay anything until they go through that trial. I think Twitter makes a pretty reasonable case that every day this goes on, they are harmed. I would imagine that's the case. I don't know how it plays out legally, though. Interesting here that the judge just got COVID. So that hearing is pushed back to a Zoom hearing. That hearing is going to take place from 11 till 1230 at the latest today is all they say. It doesn't have to be 90 minutes. Uh, so, yeah, see how that plays out. And we jump over to Twitter shares. Twitter, positive with the market. Stay tuned, folks. We got to replay this hour. Basil's out, but we got Larry live at 11. Fast Market at 12. You heard him. They're talking about some great stocks over at Fast Market. They'll be talking Netflix. They'll be talking uh, a couple other equities. Steve Rhodes, Dave White.